Good afternoon. This is Spirit Journey. Today is Tuesday, March 28th, 2017. And I hope you guys are having a great day. I want to talk about something new regarding my channel. As you all know, I'm on a Spirit Journey. And about two years ago, I started buying books. Books on any subject that will try to get me out of the box. And I was very anxious and very confused. I bought over the course of two years close to 90 books. Most of my books are right underneath this coffee table. And then I have some ebooks, maybe 12 ebooks. So I started thinking I really want to get through my books and I was slacking on it. But I really want to delve into it. And I think part of the reason that I wasn't reading as much is because of fear. But even with the meditations, I still felt a little afraid, afraid of really knowing what the truth is. And then earlier this year, I started thinking, well, you know, this year is a brand new year. And this year for me is about challenging myself and so I'm taking refresher courses in driving and I even have a VR game that does driving simulations. So I said, you know, this year I really want to start delving in deeper into this reality. So I want to try to be a little bit more systematic in this approach of getting through the books. So I want to every week, at least once a week or once every two weeks, I want to read one of the many books that I have and then I want to discuss the books. Now this isn't going to be like a critique that you know you read like a book club that that I will be reading and then saying well this and that about the book but my point is with the information that's in the book, how is how how am I going to relate to the information? How is it getting me closer to understanding the big picture? So in the course of doing that, some of the things that I may be saying may seem like I'm critiquing the book, but it's more of not the book, but the information and according to my understanding or my current paradigm system. I have here a book. I actually already started reading the book, but that's okay. But we'll finish it together. This book is called Santeria, The Religion. And I don't know how to pronounce the person's name. Now this book is published in 1989 and I got this book last year in December for my birthday actually. So I'm almost done. I'm like a little bit more than three quarters finish. And it's very interesting and I have been writing notes. Not as much notes that I really wanted to but you know with this project that I'm doing to go through these books in a systematic way what I'm going to need and any of you who want to have their own readings you know at in their own home they're also going through a spiritual awakening and they're trying to get out of the box and trying to get some light on their lives again you decide for yourself what books interest you to try to help open up your understanding. What I think would be beneficial, have a pen or some type of writing implement and have paper with you. And again, some books may have like blank pages in the back so you can actually write notes in the book. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I've actually been writing the back of the book, my notes. And I also highlight so you can get a highlighter and I also like writing notes sometimes on the actual page of the book that I'm reading. Whatever what your style is, do what is comfortable for you 
and in your own leisure, you know, after everything's done, you too could put something out on YouTube or even share in this channel, Spirit Journey, about your awakening and what you've been learning in your journey. It should be finished by this week or next week. And then I want to present another video about my understandings of this. And so hopefully every week, every two weeks after I'm finished reading, I'll do a sit down session and discuss the book that I'm reading and how it is affecting my spiritual awakening. Feel free to comment below on this video. You can share this video with friends and family members. You could subscribe to Spirit Journey. And as always, please give me the thumbs up. Okay guys, thank you again for watching. Bye bye. Hi guys, you'll need a pen, paper, highlighter, and most of all, patience to follow me along. Take care. Bye-bye.